Hey everybody, it's me, Gorgon Manorino, back for my post-market wrap-up for today. Thursday, December 14th, 2017. People, if there's one thing that you need to pay attention to, it is this. Today, and I covered this earlier, action with the bond market. Well, that turned around just like I expected it to, just like I explained it to you. As a matter of fact, savage bond buying occurred today to try and attempt to reprop up the stock market and it didn't work. I want to cover that. So in the video that I did this morning, I explained to you that stocks were higher, but bonds were selling off. As a matter of fact, throughout the day, I took snapshots of the bond market action and posted it on my social networks. Um, now, this is interesting because they, they tried, they're trying to play a game here. Uh, and it's been working time and time again for weeks. I, I mean, honestly, if you've been following this blog, I've been explaining this to you, not only explaining it to you, but I've been showing it to you in literally real time. I'm saying watch the bond market, watch how the stock market responds. And without fail, every single time, except for today, except for today, it has worked. That to me is a red flag, very important. So again, despite savage bond buying, go look at this chart, you will not believe it. Right on my website, traderschoice.net, underneath the chat room. Massive amounts of bond buying today, and the market finished the Dow Jones Industrial Average, despite the fact that it was up 90 points at one point, one time today, finished down 75 points. So that's a pretty large swing. Now, I am not sounding the alarm because I'm going to get trolled hardcore here saying that this is it, this is the market crash. No, what I am saying is you need to exercise caution right here. I mean, there's a divergence going on here. When you see divergences like this, you should, your eyes should open up a little bit and say, hey, hold on a second. Maybe it's time to pull profits. Maybe it's time to hedge my positions. I want to talk about that in a second. Um, maybe it's time to sit back and do nothing. You, know, you could play this a lot of ways here. Now, this is what I did. And I explained this to you and I posted it on all my social networks so you would know. I bought calls on SPY yesterday, okay? I've been a real bull here. Every single time we've seen them buy up those bonds, stocks have followed, except for today. So what I did, I took up a 10% hedge on that call. I also bought calls on Facebook, and I also posted this on all my social networks. I did hedge that position as well just prior to the market close. Look, these hedges here, if you play these correctly, and I outline how to do this in one of the briefs that I have available from my website, they can be your best friends, and you can sleep better at night with these little hedges in there. You just have to play it the right way. It's not hard. So those are my two positions. I have open, both hedged. We'll see how this plays out tomorrow over the next couple of days. I don't know what another way to put this, and I don't want to sound alarmist because I am not. All I am saying is they failed to prop up the stock market by propping up the bond market today. Honestly, if you follow this blog for the past weeks and weeks and weeks and weeks, you have watched it unfold exactly like I have said it would. In other words, they get in there, bond market sells off, they don't allow it to sell off, they get in here and they buy it up, stocks rebound. That did not happen today, despite truly an unbelievable amount of bomb buying. Go look at that chart. You really won't believe what you see. So with that said, caution is advised here. Um, with your positions, have them hedged. Think about getting out of the market maybe for a day or two. Look, I'm a very conservative trader. There are probably some aggressive ones out here that are saying, oh, no, absolutely not. Look, that's your style. I'm telling you my style. And my style works. Ask anybody who follows my work. Do what you got to do. I'll play this my way. Um, 
All right, so that's pretty much it, people. Let's watch and see how this plays out over the next several days. If we continue to see this action, again, the one thing that you need to watch for is this, a simultaneous sell-off, simultaneous sell-off, with, with, which will occur in the bond market and the stock market at the same time. Now, I'm not saying that this is going to happen, but when we, when we see this happen, when these things start to fall in tandem, get out. Get out of the market. I don't care what positions you might have open. I would be closing them at that particular time. That did not occur today. Again, they are buying bonds here at a fever, feverish pace today. It's unbelievable. It failed to prop up stocks. That, to me, is a red flag, people. It's a red flag. So um, with that said, let's see how this plays out tomorrow morning. We're going to talk all about this again. Uh, it's going to be very interesting. I honestly can't wait to do uh, the market report in the morning. I will see all of you there. Over and out.